I'm here at Kleinfeld's Manhattan's premier bridal store where I got to be a princess for the day. We, just like everybody else, is a buzz about what Kate Middleton will wear to the royal wedding. With the help of the staff, I got to try on four dresses that were absolutely fit for a princess. The first was a lace trumpet gown designed by Alita Graham and priced at $3,300. I also got to wear a tiara designed by Thomas Knoll. It had beautiful lace detailing with just a little bit of sparkle, clean lines, and a modest train. It was simple and yet elegant, and I think it could be right up Kate's alley. The second dress I tried on was a $25,000 gown designed by Panina Tournay, which I paired with a tiara by Deborah Moreland. This was absolutely a princess dress. It had a tight bodice and a beautiful, beautiful skirt with flower detailing. And let me tell you, it was heavy. This would give Kate quite the workout as she walks down the aisle at Westminster Abbey. Although it was heavy, it still was so beautiful and absolutely made me feel like royalty. The third dress was a Panina Tournay design priced at $9,800, which was accompanied by an Erin Cole tiara. This dress felt the most like Kate Middleton. It had classic jeweled beading at the top and a beautiful bow in the back. It definitely feels like something that Kate would wear on her big day. The last dress was by far the most extravagant. It was another beautiful ball gown designed by Pornino Tournay, bedazzled with Swarovski jewels and priced at $17,000. It was an extremely heavy dress as well and a little bit too outlandish for Kate's taste, but definitely, definitely fit for a princess. After trying on my last dress, I was beat. Let me tell you, being a princess is exhausting. But now I'm even more excited to see what Kate will decide to wear on her big day. Before leaving Kleinfelds, we sat down with co-owner Mara Urschel, who has more than 30 years of experience in the industry. We got her input as to what she thinks Kate will wear as she walks down the aisle this Friday. I think a bride who wants to be a princess, we certainly have a major selection. We have a big selection of ball gowns. Ball gown is number one. And of course, uh, it can be done in many different fabrications, satins and organzas and tools, tools being the lightest and taffeta being the lightest, uh, with sparkles and diamonds and uh, tiaras. Uh, even though headbands and, and there are many, many other choices for hair treatments, I think that if you want to be a princess, there's nothing better than a tiara.